two brothers, both rappers and almost indistinguishable from each other. This is Umar Tufail singing alongside his younger brother Amir. Times I have to look at this, I smile, and then there's times I look at it and I, and I can't really, I have to turn it off. But, you know, it's good to have this. Amir's struggling not only with the loss of his brother, but also a feeling of guilt. The gang who killed Umar were actually after him. Even though it's something silly, like a little feud I have between someone, it's, it's resulted in my brother's life being taken. So, of course, I'm going to feel guilty. And, you know, like no, no matter what anyone says can change that. It's just something, like I said, I'm going to have to live with for the rest of my life until hopefully one day we meet again and I speak to him again. We can sell things then, hopefully. Umar's killers were two teenagers, Chiron Daly on the left and Sanchez Thomas on the right. They were involved in a gang feud with the younger brother and mistook Umar for him. This week, they were sentenced to a total of 57 years in jail. Umar was sitting in his car outside his home here in Thornton Heath when Daly and Thomas drove up alongside him. They pulled out a gun and shot him once at point-blank range. Umar's father says the family have been devastated by the killing. The pain will always be there. And, and it is, you know, when I think about it, it, it is very, very difficult to come to terms with. I really wish I could press one big red button and just stop this. Amir says he's now determined to change his life and to help other young people involved in London's gang culture. If, if Umar was here now, what would you say to him? If he was here now, um, I'd just say I'm sorry, and like, I just hope he forgives me. That's that's it, and I want to make him proud. The family are now hoping to set up a charity working with vulnerable young people to try and ensure others don't have to go through what they've experienced. Sekunder Kamani, BBC London News.